Little Rabbit Foo Foo, retold by Michael Rosen, illustrated by Arthur Robbins. Can you see Little Rabbit Foo Foo? What's he riding? That's right, it's a motorbike. What's he holding in his hand? It's a hammer, a very big hammer. What do you think he's going to do with it? We're in the forest. What can you see? Can you see the field mice? And the goblins? What are the goblins doing? They're playing musical instruments. And the field mice are dancing. What else can you see? Can you find the tigers? That's right. And can you find the crows? The crows are watching the field mice dancing. And so's the badger. Can you find any other animals? There's a hedgehog and a butterfly and some wriggly worms. They're all having a lovely time in the forest. But I wonder who's coming. Hmm, little rabbit Foo Foo. Does he look kind or does he look a bit mischievous? The hedgehog is watching him and the crows are talking about him. And now he's zooming off on his motorbike. He's shocked the poor hedgehog and the crows. He's gone so quickly. Now he's trying to catch the field mice. How many field mice has he caught? One, two, three, four. And what's he doing? He's bopping them on their heads. Poor field mouse, he's hitting them on their heads. But somebody's told the good fairy. The good fairy has come to complain to little rabbit Foo Foo. Does little rabbit Foo Foo look a bit worried? Does he look concerned? I wonder what he's thinking. There is the good fairy. Can you see her wings? Is she young or is she old? Yes, she's old. She has white hair. Can you see her umbrella and her handbag? Does she look happy or does she look angry? She looks a bit angry, doesn't she? She's waving her finger and she's telling little rabbit Foo Foo off. Did little rabbit Foo Foo listen to the good fairy? No, he didn't. He's upsetting the badger and the frog now. And now he's catching the wriggly worms. How many wriggly worms did he catch? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. He's hitting them all on the head with his hammer. Can you see the bumps? on the wriggly worm's heads. I don't think they're very happy, are they? I think they're going to go and tell the good fairy. Here she comes. Yes, the wriggly worms told the good fairy about what little rabbit Foo Foo did. Little rabbit Foo Foo is very angry with the wriggly worms now. And the good fairy is angry, angry with little rabbit Foo Foo. 
I think she's shouting at him. Oh dear, little rabbit Fufu still hasn't learnt his lesson. Now he's trying to catch the tigers. And he bops them on the head and the tigers go and call for the good fairy again. Little rabbit Fufu is angry with the tigers. He's tapping his foot on the floor. And now little rabbit Fufu is trying to catch the goblins. Can you see all of the goblins? They were sitting on the toadstools and they were making their tea and toasting their bread and they were playing cards. Can you see the goblin with the cup of tea? Yes, here he is. Can you find the one who's smoking a pipe? Yes, there he is. This little goblin is trying to run away. He's trying to run into his house. I wonder if little rabbit Fufu will catch him. Oh dear, little rabbit Fufu caught all of the goblins. Can you see the goblin who's rubbing his head? Here he is. Can you see the goblin who's sticking his tongue out? That's right. Can you find the goblin who's cleaning his glasses? Here he is. And here's the goblin who's smoking his pipe. And here's the goblin with a very tall and squashed green hat. I wonder what's going to happen now. What do you think's going to happen? Yes, the good fairy has come again. Oh no, little rabbit Fufu is angry. He has his hammer. Is he going to try and hit the good fairy? I hope not. Let's see what happens. Look, the good fairy has hit little rabbit Fufu with her handbag. She's cast her magic spell and she's changed him into a goonie. Now he's a goonie. He's not very strong anymore. He can't pick up his hammer 